Good afternoon, welcome back. It is Friday, December 15th, halfway through the month. A little over, well, not quite halfway, I guess. Tomorrow at noon will be exactly halfway. But pretty much halfway through the month of December, so we're nearing the end of this series. We've got three birthdays to talk about today, but no events. So again, much like January, December is going to go out in pretty much the same way with just a, a smattering of events throughout the end of the month. So let's talk about our birthdays. Born on this day in 1991, part-time IndyCar, part-time NASCAR driver. He's also uh, worked with uh, Dirty Mo Media and a few other media ventures. That would be Mr. Connor Daly. Of course, he's kind of a hometown boy up here and has uh, had some success at Indy. Has had some good runs, but never really has had that quote-unquote top ride. But hopefully he'll get that at some point and, and can really, really do well. He's I think he ran that, what was it called, the A1GP or something like that as well a few years ago. Did pretty good there. Our next birthday, I'm flipping and flopping, deciding which way to go on this. So we'll stick with NASCAR. Born on this day in 1994, current driver for the number 14 Stuart Haas Racing Fords, Chase Briscoe, rookie of the year a couple years ago. Won Phoenix in 2022. Had a plethora, nine wins, I believe, in the Xfinity Series in, what was that, 2020? And uh, he was a Roush development or Ford development driver for a few years in the Xfinity Series. There you see some of the various sponsors and uniforms he's had over the last handful of years. <clears throat> but that Stuart Haas racing has just been riddled with bad luck the last few years and bad performances. Hopefully they can get that turned around. And our final birthday, born on this day in 1953, worked many, many years for MRN, worked on TV with uh, the Nashville Network, TNN, for a brief moment, and uh, currently is uh, one of the lead announcers for Alabama football. That'd be Mr. Eli Gold. And here you see two variations of his 91 tracks. One with black lettering, one with white lettering. And I think the difference is one came in the... Maybe one came in the factory set, one was in the packs, don't know. There you see him in the MRN booth. Worked beside Barney Hall for many, many years. As he eventually went to the uh, TV booth, replacing Mike Joy for a brief time with TNN. But all these are going to be MRN-related cards. Like I said, and I guess he just overcame... Uh, cancer so hopefully he's in good health again but again born on this day 1953 eli gold so anyway thanks again for watching a little bit of a short video today it'll get you on your way to your weekend a little bit quicker so make sure you come back tomorrow and we'll see you then